And there goes the whistle. Full time. Manchester United nil. Liverpool three. Yes, it's another slap down. Yes, people talk about this as preseason. The results don't matter. But you know what? It is an embarrassment. It is an embarrassment. And getting pumped by a new coach that has just come on for Liverpool is an embarrassment. It is a really, really embarrassment. And it's not that we lost. It's the fact that the way we lost this game is embarrassing. Even after 60 minutes, Liverpool put all the bench players. They put all the bench players. And we still, we still could not manage to, to create chances. I only remember one or two chances in the second half, bro. Maybe one for Scott McTominay, but that's about it. And we've got Anthony in there. We got Scott McTominay. We got Ericsson. We got Casemiro. Onana still playing. Look, this team has got no hope. I've got no hope in this team. And we're just going to have to pray for the next season or for this season. I seriously, seriously think that this, this, this manager is beyond clueless. He's beyond Ted Lasso. The changes he made playing Jaden Sancho as a center forward. Why are you playing Jaden Sancho as a center forward? He doesn't play center forward for Dortmund. And Dortmund made it all the way to the Champions League final. Jaden Sancho playing out wide. Somehow he comes here, he puts him in the center forward position. I don't get it. I seriously don't get it. And then in the second half, he puts Scott McTominay up top. Scott McTominay, not a while ago, plays center back for Scotland. Somehow, is he playing center forward now for Manchester United? I mean, these are just a couple of things that I've noticed, but there's millions in this match. Millions of mistakes from this manager, and I think we should definitely, definitely get rid of him. For sure. The sooner we get rid of him, the better. I'm just letting you guys know. Some of you guys said ten, 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 ten hag in. I was never ten hag in. I was never ten hag in. And she just doesn't convince me. It's not about the loss. Like I said, this is preseason. I'm not overreacting. I'm just giving you my opinion in, on, on this manager. How he's setting up this team. Where is the flow? Where is it? I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't know the plan. I don't know what he's trying to do in this, in this team. And... Only God knows what's going to happen with Manchester United. But yeah, guys, I've had enough of this guy. I've had enough of this this clown. Uh, Zach, Mike, Joseph, uh, D, Choco, uh, Christian, all of you, man. Big up all of you for staying. But for staying this late and to watch this shit, that's just an embarrassment. But yeah, thank you all for joining us. Make sure you smash the like on the stream. Subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel. But yeah, I'm out of here. That's an embarrassment. We got Manchester City coming up in the Community Shield next week. It could be another embarrassment. Who knows? Who knows? Hopefully we turn up. Sometimes we turn up just like we turned up in the FA Cup final. We could turn up in the Community Shield. Who knows? But watching all the preseason games, I don't feel comfortable heading into that match. You guys, let me know your thoughts about that match. Who's going to win? What we're going to do this season with with Ten Hag in charge. Where is Manchester United going to finish in the top four or top five, top ten? You guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment sections. But again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out. Good night. Peace.